You've never been pushed up against the wall. Shit! How you feel? Fine, sir. How you feel? Fine, sir. How do we get access to this, uh, Jackson? His lawyers say they can get me in posing as a legal investigator. Hey, it's wrong, he honed his writing skills, reading various revolutionary theorists during four years in solitary confinement. You have two hours. Shoot! I've been waiting for this for a long time. We need brothers who can maintain their self-respect if you have true strength. Do you understand that there cannot be a peaceful revolution? The gunman also stated, we are the revolutionaries. The Soledad brothers must be freed. Hi, David Dreyer. So George said it was okay to look at them. Which ones do you want to see? All of them. Some people are comparing your work to Elvis Cleaver, Richard Wright, Du Bois. How does your fame affect you when you're locked up all day? Hello. That was him. This here is Jonathan. He's comrade George's younger brother. On the morning of August 7th, 1970, Jonathan Jackson walked into the Marin County courtroom. He announced that he was taking over, adding, this is it. Everybody freeze. We did it, man. We made it, man. They're holding up, I think. So I got my little brother, huh? Mr. Jackson, I'm sorry about your brother. They will live to regret it. I'll see you today. You hit him where it hurts. All right, ladies, lights out. Because this is the revolution and we are the vanguard.